Jumbo everyone, welcome back. So today I'm going to show you how I made these lovely condatums or sun-dried vegetables. And these are super easy to make. All you have to do is cut the vegetable into thin slices, marinate them and sun-dry them. These are usually made during the summer because um, we need the sun. But you can also dry it under the fan but it will take a bit longer. Obviously, right? Once they are dried crispy, store in an airtight container and when ready to use, fry and eat with rice, kanji or you can use it in curries also. So here I've used eggplants and they are homegrown. You can just see how amazing they look. Anyways, let's get back to the topic. So you can use anything. It doesn't only have to be eggplants. It can be bitter gourd, it can be jackfruit, long beans and even chilies. In fact, there are these chilies that are good for these condatum and they are marinated dipped in buttermilk and then sun dried and they are perfect with curd rice anyway so let's start just to let you guys know i have used 13 eggplants over here so first we will cut the head like that and then we will cut it um, long like that like that and uh, now we will cut these into a half like this now we will um, slice them so I found it easier slicing it this way and Try to slice them as thin as possible. Now you can cut these into in two ways. First one you can leave it like this or you can cut these um, slices into a half again. But I would prefer leaving it a bit thicker because they're going to shrink anyways. But it's either way it's fine. Now it's not really hard but the slicing part you need to really try and be as thin as possible if you want it really crispy because um, if it's a bit thick I don't think it will be as crispy as you would want it to be but either way it's sun drying so I'm sure it should be fine but well, let's get it done. So you see from these I am not going to cut it into half. And like that we cut the rest. Now next we have to marinate it. So I am going to add in a bit of turmeric powder. And yes, the um, kadai is swirling on its own. <laughs> Anyways, so that's a bit of turmeric powder. Next, I will add a bit of um, salt. Yep, that's to taste. Um, but a bit more because we're going to fry it and have it, you know, so. Yep. And next, I will add a bit of chili powder, red chili powder. There. So hmm, that looks good. <laughs> so now we have to mix it. Now this is how you mix it. You juggle it around I guess. That's what you say. Um, just keep doing it till it mixes well. Or if you're not really familiar with this, you can use forks I guess. But this is better. Marinated and well coated. So let's get it sun dried. So the first day I used a banana leaf to sun dry my um, eggplant slices. So this is it. I have washed it and let it to dry. I am keeping the pieces one by one and um, well the sad part is I started off thinking that my camera was on but I realized later that it was off. Oopsie. <laughs> Anyways you can see I have well distributed the pieces so it dries properly. So you can see here it's a bit dried. Um, all the water content has been soaked dry. 
the leaf also now it's even more dry now this is um, towards the evening when I'm about to take it in because you don't want to keep it once the Sun goes down you can see it's a bit dry but not to the much we want it but that's the, the end of day one day two so I put these out in the morning um, you can see that they are shrinking in size and they are getting dry but let's see how it is in the evening by afternoon well it went from two newspapers to one newspaper so yep it definitely shrinking and drying so now it's evening and it's time to take it back in can you hear that sound perfect isn't it you can actually try and have them right away now just in case you want to store it for a longer time or you're traveling you want to take it with you I would suggest you keep it out in the Sun under the Sun for a day more and that's what I've done here day 3 and now we're near the end of day 3 finally and these are done perfectly done so I'm going to take them in um, sorry for all the clanking but you can hear the crispiness of it can't you I hope you do now these are ready to be stored into an airtight container so now let's try and fry some and see how they turn out so one thing is you should not let it sit and fry no you put it in when the oil is hot and you remove it within a second otherwise it's going to be really burnt and that's done so these are how it look perfectly fried fondatums or sun fried vegetables so that's the end of my video i hope you guys liked it please do like share and subscribe please do try it out before the rains come in till next time bye bye take care stay at home stay safe